What is up, you guys? It's your boy, Bill For Anything, and it's been two years. Two years. This is a moment to celebrate. Two years anniversary of me leaving New York to move to Dallas, Texas. And I want to share with you guys some of the things that I've been up to, some of the updates. First of all, I can tell you this right away. The people here are still awesome. Okay, I, I've had some great interactions. I've met some really, really awesome people. A couple flakes here and there, but you know, that comes with the territory. Also, I could tell you that the summertime here in Texas is, is no joke, okay? I probably experienced the hottest summer that I've ever experienced in my life just recently, okay? Winter time is a complete breeze, especially if you're from the East Coast and you're used to having large piles of snow, this is just, it's, it's a breeze, okay? You can just get right through this winter time, easy breezy, okay? Um, what I've also noticed is that not only have I grown as an individual since being here, but my area has grown, the city has grown. I've driven past plenty different places, including my area where I see new developments like large developments. So that tells me that there's money that's being pumped into the city. That So there's gonna be opportunities uh, for people as well. And you have more and more people moving into the city, which I know some people are not very ecstatic about. Uh, but again, you know, it's it's that means that when a city is growing at a rapid pace, that it's bringing in a lot of people. And I think that it, the city is large enough to sustain it. That's just my opinion. Um, but even so, over the two years, guys, I've been getting messages from a lot of you guys saying, hey, this video has helped me in making my decision or that video has helped me making my decision and this thing you said or that thing you said have helped me. And I can tell you guys, I'm extremely, extremely humbled by it. And I try to respond to every comment um, I can, right? Especially if it's something that I think um, is a legit question. Because here's the thing, guys, I've made a couple of videos, you know, on the topics of being in Dallas. And sometimes what happens is a video will end, right? And then it's like, damn, you know, I forgot to mention this. So I forgot to mention that. Because when you do these videos, you understand that you really got a short time frame to really get what it is that you want to say out there. But even still, sometimes you're saying to yourself, damn, you know, oh, I could have mentioned this. But you gotta move on to your next video and, and your next concept. And so it got me to create a guide um, called The Mover's Mindset. And The Mover's Mindset is an ebook that I, that I created where I really took all my thoughts, all the mentality that really got me to this moment and my interactions with other people. I have a friend who I remember he relocated from uh, New York. We grew up together to live in LA at a very young age. Um, and he's he's flourishing. Um, he lives currently in Portland. I have a good friend of mine who relocated over to another country. Um, and she's lived in Paris for a little bit. She's lived in um, Martinique for a while. Uh, so I've noticed some things in people who make that big of a decision, all right? And what their mindset is to kind of pick up and go and change their environment. And so I noticed those similarities and I also noticed in my conversations with people who feel like they can't make those kind of changes or they don't want to make those kind of changes for whatever reason. And so I came up with this guide to really help you guys out there who really want to understand or just dive a little bit deeper into what is it that's holding me back or what is it that I need to know so that way when I make these changes in my life that I can I can flourish anywhere that I'm at, right? And so I really, really believe that it's a mindset and that there are things that really go into it that's not as simple as just making a video, right? Like there's more that goes into it. And so this guide I, I really believe is gonna help a lot of you guys, especially going into the new year if you're somebody who's thinking like, you know, I need to make a change. Um, you know, I just don't know what it is or I can't pinpoint it. 
I think you're really gonna benefit from this guide. You're gonna learn a lot, especially about what my mindset was going into making a decision like this, um, again, and as well as other people that I've picked their brain along the way. Um, I really think it's, you're gonna benefit from it. So, if you haven't checked it out, definitely check it out. It's the Movers Mindset, it's in my Selfie store. I'm gonna put the link down below uh, for you guys to click on it and check it out. Um, pick it up. Like I said, I really took my time in really, really breaking this down. And I think it's going to help you walk away with a entirely different mindset and approach to making a decision like this um, to where you can be confident in making a move, um, but then also be realistic, right? And understand and know what to expect. All right. So definitely beneficial. But again, guys, overall, I wouldn't change a thing. I really, really would not change a thing. I love being here. Um, I, I, I just, until that changes, guys, this is where I call home. So if you've been rocking with me, I definitely appreciate you. If you've been keeping up with the podcast, definitely appreciate you. If you haven't checked out my website, definitely check out the website. The link is down below. Um, it's so many facets. To that to that website i think there's something there for everybody so definitely check it out that's it guys just wanted to update you um let you know what it is and before i go the traffic sheesh talk about i had to i was stuck in traffic for over an hour and it was only 15 miles away it was only 15 miles away from where i was to where i needed to be it took me an hour okay it gets a little crazy around here at certain times, all right? Not LA crazy, but listen, the traffic is still a, it's still a pain, all right? But anyway, guys, that's it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Share this video with anybody you think it will be beneficial to them. Hit that like button. Drop those comments down below. I read everything I answer back. And for the new subscribers, welcome to the Built Nation. Appreciate you. Peace and love. I'll catch you on the next video. I'm out.